You're on. All right. Hi. So I'm Sebastian. Uh, this is a robot I built. My name is Isadora. Um, Isadora is a robot that will dance with you. So what we have is a small replica here of Isadora with all the same joints and configuration um, and an encoder in each joint. And what we're doing is we're reading the position of these encoders uh, using an NIDAG card and feeding it into the PC. We do some processing and send it to two compact Rio controllers with 9505 motion modules on board. Then we, uh, we're controlling these, uh, these seven motors. Each one controls a single axis of the robot. So there's one that rotates the shoulder, one that hinges the shoulder, and one for the elbow, and an additional joint to rotate the torso. Um, I guess there's not a whole lot else to do except show you a quick little demonstration. You can see here, I'm just going to turn the robot on and move it into position so it catches it. As you can see, it's coming to life. The one arm is coming to life at least. But um, there's some minor time on the robot. But the robot is, is responding to what I'm doing. So, you know, in this, in this case, we're, only, we're really only mirroring what this replica does. But there's no reason why this couldn't be providing input to some other sort of artificial intelligence uh, li library or some code. And doing, you know, making the robot dance, maybe it processes some music. Um, all sorts of possibilities are really available. If you don't want to use the replica, use a motion capture suit. Really sort of an endless list of possibilities. And if you want to learn more, you can go to ni.com robotics.